Hey everyone, how's it going out there? This is Erin Gallardo again. Uh, I wanted to jump on today because our NeuroTribe only has one more day that we're open. So I wanted to jump on and see if anyone has any questions or any comments or anything you wanna share about it or anything we can help you with. So um, I am one of the founders of the NeuroTribe and this is a community that we've created to help neurotherapists to grow their careers and expand their impact. And it's been super fun project. Um, and we are just loving it so much and the people in there. And so I did want to jump on again to, to talk to you a little bit more about some of the people we have in our neuro tribe, some of the people who've reached out to us, because we really feel like there's probably a lot of you out there who are very similar to them. And maybe you can relate to some of these stories and it'll help you get a sense of whether you think this is something that could be right for you. So, um, you know, fit is really important for us and as well as timing. So we understand that some things um, are good to do now and some things are down the road, but um, we definitely want to reach out to you and have you reach out to us if you have any questions about whether you think this could be something that would work for you. Um, so just to talk a little bit about some of the questions that we've gotten so far in case that's something coming up for you. Um, we've had some questions from therapists reaching out. Um, just asking whether they feel like they are in a position right now where it might be a good thing for them to join. So um, we had a therapist who asked us, you know, she said she wants to start her own mobile practice, um, but she's scared and she doesn't really quite know how to navigate it. And she really wants a place that she can help, uh, that can help her stay accountable to her goals and not get too scared and kind of chicken out on it. So um, yeah, so she joined our group. And um, we also have had some OTs reach out, which has been really cool. We don't have, we didn't have any OTs in our group yet, um, but now we do. So that's really awesome. And she as well is starting a mobile practice and she isn't quite sure what direction to take it. So we're really excited to have her in the group and working with us and the other therapists and, and trainers and fitness professionals, everybody in the group um, to help her guide that. Um, we've had a PT who's really experienced who reached out and, um, and came along with us and she wants to create a community exercise class um, for seniors and she's really looking for a sounding board and some input and other things to help her guide that. So um, it's pretty awesome. And as well as just a PT who's really looking to work with some other peers who are interested in, in elevating the profession. And we're totally about that. So we were really pumped to welcome him into the group also. So um, those are some of the people that we've had reaching out to us and joining us and becoming part of our awesome team in the Neuro Tribe. So pretty cool there. Um, definitely reach out and ask us your questions if you feel like you are not sure um, if, if it's the right thing for you or the right timing for you. Because honestly, it's been really cool. We have had some people reach out to us um, who say like, you know, this sounds awesome. This sounds like exactly like something I want to do. But you know what? I'm not quite ready right now. And that's pretty cool. Like, we really love to hear from them and, and hear that about you because we do know like timing is, is pretty important and we want you to know that we're here for you in all kinds of ways. So um, it's, it's not a problem at all. You're, you know, you are our colleagues, our peers, and we support you and we're here for you. And um, you know, if it's not the right time right now, that's totally fine. Um, you know, we, we want to be able to support you when it is the right time and answer any other questions you might have. So um, don't hesitate to reach out for, to us, even if that is where you are right now. And maybe we can even have a dialogue around your timing and what you're thinking about for yourself so that you can sort of plan um, for what you want to do for the future. Um, you know, we're just really here to help benefit the profession and help people just overcome obstacles and reach higher goals than they thought that they could do on their own. Um, you know, some people really are ready uh, to, to be working with us. They are ready to launch their own thing. Um, maybe they're transitioning into their own side gig or they're thinking about it and they're in the planning stages. We have people in that place in their career. Um, we have people who are just really craving that mentorship and collaboration from peers who are very similar to them because we have people across the entire country in here. So you get different perspectives and different ways of looking at things. So 
Um, they're hoping to get uh, just a little bit more input and new, um, new outside ideas to collaborate with. So um, those are some of the things that, that we're seeing in our group and some of the people joining. And, and I know that um, you out there are probably in one of these places as well. So um, we would really love to hear from you if, if this is something that you think could be helpful for you or if there's something that you think would be helpful to have in it to help you move along in your path. Um, you know, and then I, I also want to talk to you a little bit about some of the people that we have been working with. So we uh, started this Neuro Tribe in, at the end of October of 2018, and it was, you know, an idea we had in our minds for a long time. We were just really excited about it. It was something that we wanted to do because it was something that we would have wanted ourselves and we just enjoy we get really excited collaborating with other neurotherapists and fitness professionals so um so we launched it out uh in october and we've been working with some people in the group then since then and um i'll tell you about some of the people that we've had in our group and some of the things they've been experiencing because it might be helpful to just hear kind of what they're feeling and how it's been going for them um, so one of the members that we have in our group since the beginning is sarah and she's a personal trainer. She works with people with Parkinson's. Um, she's been doing a mobile practice and kind of jumping around um, from people's homes and renting space in gyms and things like that, doing classes, doing one-on-ones. Um, and she joined because her biggest question was how could she have the highest quality fitness studio and mostly specializing in Parkinson's, but also working with Boomer Fitness as well. Um, she really wanted, she has a couple staff and, and um, one that's a PT and one that's soon to be a PT. And she's looking to offer them a full-time job and something competitive um, and, and also finding a way to incorporate the physical therapy into her fitness practice. Um, she feels like she's gotten a lot of benefit out of the conversations that we've had. We have these small groups, uh, small group meetings where we get to talk to people. We call them our accountability groups. And um, we've gotten the opportunity to talk with her about some specific business situations, give some suggestions and ideas on pricing and on the structure of her classes and memberships um, and uh, packages that she's offering. And she felt like that was really helpful, um, giving her some specific ideas to take back to her place and um, try to implement. And she recently got her own um, space. So that's been another cool transition. I forget if I said that, um, but she has her own space now and transitioning into that. And um, how is that shaping up and um, just being able to ask questions of people who have been there and kind of done that route. Um, so that's been helpful as well. And um, Sarah's someone though, she, she's really motivated and she, she does, she doesn't mind taking some risks and um, she just really loves to do what she's doing and she wants to really be the best out there But she identified herself as like pretty technologically challenged So I think we've had a few people mentioning that in our group because it's online. So there's definitely technology that's involved and um, You know, but it's been okay. Like they have grace with themselves I think honestly the programs that we use are not too complicated. We haven't really had a lot of snafus or anything we record things so they can watch them later. Um, it hasn't been too much of a problem, but I know that there's been a little bit of fear for some of the group members around like, oh, I'm not very technology savvy, but um, that has been going okay. And, and they've been able to overcome that fear and really push themselves, which has been helpful because now they're able to work and talk with people that they would never potentially meet in person. So, um, so that was that was Sarah. She's uh, she's been just so fun to work with and see her business growing in just a few months. Um, another person that we've been working with in our group is Lisa, and she's an experienced PT who was kind of hesitant to join, actually. And maybe some of you are feeling this way as well. She wasn't really sure. Like, I don't know what this is about. Is this going to help me? Um, but she thought, well, what could I lose? I mean, I might as well try. And um, she has just been expressing so much to us about how much she loves the interactions, the connections, and really the spirit of what we're doing in the group. And um, she's hoping for more collaboration. And so this is another reason why we're hoping to get more people in too, because it is great to have like a, a 
expansive group of people that you can relate to and talk to about different issues. Um, so she's really pushed herself to get out of her comfort zone, try something new. And um, she has had some changes in her outlook and um, in her work life and her schedule. And she took the NCS exam. Um, so yeah, she's been really awesome to work with in our group too. And then I'll tell you as well about Jenny. She's another physical therapist who is working with us. And um, some of the things that she told us about was that before joining the Neuro Tribe, she was really looking for inspiration within her neuro career. And she wanted to think outside of the box of traditional healthcare models, but she felt like she needed some more support to implement her ideas. And since joining the Neuro Tribe, she said that it's been motivating her to connect with other passionate neuro professionals from around the country. She's found it really invaluable to have the opportunity to collaborate with the rest of the group and um, you know, doing that through the group calls, through our workshops, through the accountability groups, she's been really finding that so valuable and helpful. Um, you know, she's someone with a young child and she's married and then obviously working full time, which is actually pretty typical of uh, most of our members. So um, you're not alone out there with a busy life and really why we created this is um, not to make you busy or not to overwhelm you or to make more work um, but to make things easier for you. So uh, we have a lot of people who are very busy also. And, you know, she said that it is difficult to balance her busy work and home life. But one of the most beneficial parts of having the Neuro Tribe has been that she's able to set aside time each month to identify and work on her, her career vision. So before joining, she really had more of a vague sense of what she wanted to accomplish. Um, but being a part of the Neuro Tribe has actually helped her to stay more accountable to her own professional goals. So that was really cool to hear her talk about that and, and show that, you know, she can still work and be a mom and wife and have all these life things that are super important to all of us. And we highly encourage and want you to have a very balanced life. But that also includes a piece where you carve out the time to look into what you want to accomplish and your career goals and your vision. And it doesn't mean that you're like climbing a mountain, like now sprinting, up, ah, trying to get to your goals. It really is about these little moments that you can take time for yourself and see like, what am I doing and reflect on it and talk with others and just stay inspired and motivated. So um, yeah, it's been really fun, really, really fun getting to know everyone. Um, that we've gotten to know in our group so far and getting to know those of you who've reached out to us. Um, we're excited to welcome the new people that we have coming in. And, you know, they are really excited to collaborate and work with you also. So, um, yeah, we only have one more day to join this round. And, um, you know, we're not going to offer it at this price again because we're trying to grow the group. So it's it's a lower price point. Um, it's definitely comparable to what you would pay for a Con Ed course, less than many Con Ed courses, but because you can implement things along the way throughout the year, and we're going to be throwing in a lot of surprises and things as we go, as we continue to build and grow this, it's just well worth it. Um, so definitely go to our website, neurocollaborative.com, and there's a link there. You can click on Neuro Tribe and read all kinds of stuff about it all the details. We have some videos on there you can watch. So definitely check that out. And there's the link to join on there. Um, if you have any questions for us here, um, please leave them in the comments. Um, let us know what you're thinking. And also don't hesitate to reach out on email. We know some people feel more comfortable to um, just send us a private message because um, the neural world is small and, and you might not want everything to be public. And, and that's part of the reason our group is not on social media and we keep things very confidential and private and within the group. So um, reach out to us at info at neurocollaborative.com and ask any questions that you might have. Um, you know, one, one more day, we would love to see you in there. Um, so don't miss out on this opportunity right now. Uh, we'll be opening it later in the year, but like I said, we're not going to be offering at the same price. So um, if you're ready for it or you're almost ready for it and you think you might want to join, definitely check us out and see if it's um, the right fit for you. And we really have some cool things coming to our members down the pipeline. Um, 
We've been putting a lot more time into planning ahead what we want to do. We have some speakers talking on cool topics like motivational interviewing. Um, we're going to get a Medicare speaker in there to talk about specific neuro issues for all of us. We can have them all to ourselves and ask our specific neuro -y questions. Um, we're thinking about some virtual summits and lots and lots more. So um, definitely reach out if um, you're ready and interested and we would love to hear from you. Um, I don't see any other questions right now. So thanks so much for tuning in and hope to hear from you soon. Bye.